Hi, I'm Matt Wieters, here to tell you some great tips you can use for the ACT standardized test. Let's explore, shall we? Stop. Scott here is still on his computer late at night. This could pose a huge threat to his testing ability. Now let's see how well Scott will do on his test. And action. That's what I thought. Scott got so little sleep that he fell asleep on his desk. Not the best pillow, right? So remember, get plenty of sleep. And now for our next scene. Food in action. And action. If you want to test well, eat something healthy before entering your testing scene. Remember to bring a snack with you on your break. Let's find out exactly what to and what not to bring on test day. And action. Bring at least two number two pencils, your admission ticket, your calculator, and a valid ID, like a school ID or driver's license. Have everything prepared the night before test day. And please, don't bring crayons to the test center. We won't be able to test with these. Also, it can be cold in testing rooms, so remember to dress well, or you might just fall asleep, like Scott. Now, this next scene is why you should know the exact location of where you're going to test. And action. Yo, dog, are we in the right place? And look at this place. I think it's the right place, isn't it? No, man, this isn't the right place. This isn't the right place? No. Man, let's go find out. Come on. Let's go see some stuff. Wrong. Don't be like me. Check before you arrive on test day. Whenever you do find a test center, sign in and sit where your instructor tells you to. And please, don't cheat on the test. These tips for the ACT will surely help you on your way to a successful test. This is Matt Wieters, signing off.